some defense here with Wenzel Sanos, pesky defense against Kringle. And they want Fiera to be able to establish his inside interior defense against the Anti Doha Plaza. And immediately, Fiera yeah. yeah. down the global for the Anti Doha was a post step for the first two points of the Very dangerous offensive threat on the floor. Sets up Jensen for three. This is go. Yancy Del Campo offensive rebound. And drops the glass in. in. That's four different players now. Scored by Paulo Taha for the offensive rebound. Del Campo posting up the alley. YDO with a hook. And the finish. And you know it's a global point taking this lead. Crashed into. Oh, I'm, sorry. I'm sorry. You're new first. Pangalawa looks at an. Springle looking to go one on one against Buen Suceso. Beats Yancy Del Campo with a hook and the yes. finish. Nice pick and roll that time, Yancy. Keep it simple. As you look at Stanley Pringle, unselfish play, feeding Yancy Del Campo inside for the hook and the finish. You know, among one Pinoy play off the half. Or, uh, and Lex, you know, one thing about this small lineup for Global Court, they're quicker, but at the same time, now that Pringle will be on a board, Boran, he will have to close out a lot longer because they will just shoot over him. Oh, Stanley Pringle inside, dips it up and dumps it down. Pero, be patient, Chagalang. This will not come easy, but it will if you play to win. As he responds to Ina by saying, we will give no mercy. Ha, Spartan attitude, how's that, Nico? Thank you very much. That's Miss Mara. Do with this opportunity. You know that he is 6'9", you know he can shoot from the outside. You know, and if you were giving him minutes just like that, able to block that sharp as Lava to revive his career just to be more successful. Well, look at this, Yancy right on cue. Back to back highlights para dito sa global. He knew exactly what to do was to be patient and he was able to get the basket. 87 80, Terrence in the corner. Terrence drives middle, Matata pick. Yancy Salo, oh, big shot by the veteran. That's a good point. You know, when you look at the bench of the Batang Piera, aside, of course, from Yancy, from uh, uh, Apagnot, from uh, Buena Fe, these, these are a lot of young guys here in the BBA. Oh, yes. you know, they have a good play. Hello, Minuto Nati Tiral sa Uno Yugto, three point lead. Para sa San Miguel BM in 18 to 15. Apagnot, the Yancy de Ocampo. Second hit from mid range, four points in the game. Lineup. Everybody's expecting San Miguel to win. Kaya naman lalong tumataas yung pressure para sa kanya. Pero sabi ni Coach Leo Austria, kung walang pressure, walang kwenta. And with this pressure, nasa challenge si Coach na mag-isip ng mga paraan on how they can continue. Testing nila, no? Buwapasok. Nakaay sa si Belga. Tapos sige, dito si Gabe Norwood naman. The Cruz boys committing that error a while ago. Di nang ka-sundo dun sa pasa. And yan si Dio Campo, so deep. Right under that basket, the big man gets it. Offensive rebounds or passing off the double team if he's at the low block. Three point play complete, the lead is up to seven. Five points na para kay Raymond Almazan. Yancy, meron oh, talaga yes. yan. He can shoot that outside shot. That's a three. So far so good for Global Port in terms of defense. They have two defensive situations there. Tapos kanina si Alex Cabagdon forcing the turnover on Gabe Norwood. So that's good news for them. And then they get the easy two points inside. Two three on the Jeremy Cruz free throw. He's in double digits with 10. But not. Inside to Yancy, the jumper. Paso! Nice mid-range shooting that time. Welcoming na technical foul sa kanya last game. Eh, ikinagulat niya. Kaya naman sa game ngayon, kung mapapansin nyo, kada matawagan ito ng foul ang team niya. At may violent reaction ang kanyang best. Eh, nangungulan na siya sa pagpapakalma. Sa Miranda. Yancy against Benisi. Classic matchup down low. Yancy PP hit. Fade away, left handed jumper is good. And Yancy Del Campo is always going to be good for that shot. Amarin yung nasabi ni Riza kanina. Only 7 points in their last game against San Miguel when they lost by 26 points. Prior to that game, he was actually averaging 28 points. So ngayon, magandang. On that particular layup of uh, Ellis, he was just dead set. He will attack that basket. He will attack the defense of Yancy Del Campo. But on the other side, naman. Guy who's supposed to be playing this moment of the game. This one. Oh, when he blocked the UC Tad there, right? Well, there's a lot of assists. Yeah, see. You know, that's a mark also of a general player. 
Yancy was doing other things. Nakaka-assist, nakaka-rebound, nakaka-bloodshot. Oh, nice swipe by Baroka. But Semarat retrieves it. Mark Isip, air ball. Yancy connects. That's first two points off the offensive rebound. Hustle of Alex Cabotron, another rebound. There's Buenafe on the break. Del Campo in the post against a smaller pick from Will. Tries to beat Jensen. He gets it back. Del Campo the hook and the finish. Nice soft hands from the big 